This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com. We have the great Zuchus to be at, first before to be at, to find the Kever of Rab Shol of Amsterdam, who was born in 1717, he was born in 1790. Rab Shol of Amsterdam, you see over here, Binyan Ariel, is the son of Rab Aryeh Leib of Amsterdam, who is the son-in-law of the Chacham Tzvi. So he's also the grandson of Rab Shol of Krakow, which makes him the great-grandson of the Rebbe Rab Heshel. So you see a very long line of a great dynasty. He wrote the Sefer on Chumash, Binyan Ariel. He wrote a Sefer on Chumash that he published in 1762, HaChatzar HaChadasha. We have Piske Halacha on him about the status of, status of Dutch cheese that he wrote in a country as Halacha Lama Asarav. Now, he was first a Rav in Hungary. He was a Rav in Dubna. He wrote Hagois on Mesech Danida, on Shulchan Aruch. And this is very interesting. In the year Tov Kuf Lamed Ches, 1778, who came to Amsterdam? The, Ramcha, um, the Chida. And the Chida went to visit Rav Shol of Amsterdam. And says the Chida in the Shem Agdoilim, Va'ani hadal zochisi lekabel penei hashchina. I was zoicha to receive the countenance of the Shechina, mi avri b'shlichos mitzvah, when I was coming through Amsterdam to collect for the yeshivas, V'zachisi lehisbaseim mi toirasai. I was zoicha to be well, taken in by the beautiful aroma of his Taira, umeyan v'sanusai, and from his humility, v'shleimusai in his wholesomeness. The Binyan Ariel wrote a Haskama to a very great tzaddik. Now this tzaddik, his whole life they pursued him. The rabbis of Venice pursued him. Ad, ad mamish, ad nefesh. And he comes to Amsterdam. Now, not only did the Rab- Rabbanim of Venice pursue him, the Chacham Tzvi wrote very uh, strongly against Rav Moshe Chaim Lutzato, as did Rav Yaakov Emden. However, we do know that they both retracted. So you say, how do we know that they retracted ag- uh, against Ramchal? Because the Binyan Ariel, who is the, the son of Rabbi Ariel of Amsterdam, not only retracted, but wrote a Haskama for the Ramchal on one of his uh, latest svarim. He retracted, they retracted their original opinion when they met him personally when the Ramchal came to Amsterdam. So in one of the later svarim of the Ramchal, we have a Haskama of Rab Shol of Amsterdam from the Binyan Ariel. Now, when the Binyan Ariel passed away and they took out his coffin, they took out his bear from his house, it started pouring in Amsterdam. And the moment the Mita left Amsterdam, the skies cleared up. And that was a simon min hashamayim. The Binyan Ariel was mamish one of the G'doy Oilam. He was ben lamed he shanim haya b'malchai. And he was nifter at 73 years old, Shabbos Kodesh, Bishas Mincha, and he was buried on Sunday, the eighth day of Tammuz, in the year Vatehi Hamisra Al Shechmai Tehei Nishmasrei Tzura B'Tzvar Hachaim. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.